I think this floats, so I don't know if this is gonna like float up the hole or what, but uh, today we are after some brook trout. Um, I'm talking like brookies, hopefully, we'll see. Um, but we are gonna put jaw jackers out with minnows, jaw jackers with a gulp. We're gonna be in here jigging little wax worms. We're literally, we're trying to figure these fish out today. We know they're here. Uh, we haven't had great luck at catching them, um, but we've been very close. So hopefully we can line it all up today and make it happen. So we're gonna get a jaw jacker set, show you what we're doing, and then uh, join us for this adventure of fishing. Let's go. So on this, I have a super duper duper tiny treble hook, and we're gonna take some trout bait. I don't know guys, I don't know if this is gonna work or not, but we're gonna figure it out. Like, when they put them in here, they're like three years old. And you gotta think, in the last three years what have they been feeding what are those fish used to eat you know and I'm thinking they eat pellets so I'm making a little ball here now hopefully it doesn't float yeah it doesn't so we're gonna record on this camera we're gonna drop our thing down and now think about trout you're only fishing a couple feet of water usually if it's like stocked brook trout like we're after today um, you want to find trees that are off. There's a nice big pine tree right here that we're set up off of and uh, That looks amazing. Hopefully they will sniff it and This will go So now we just uh, go inside. Let's get set up the rest of the way in there Hello, how are you? I am under the water this guy right here super small little fat head minnow actually this is just a crappie minnow but hopefully he gets eaten we're gonna put him on this little tiny treble hook it's like a number 15 treble hook hook him right behind the dorsal fin if I can get the hook in there tiny tiny fish tiny hooks equal big fish like I said today's kind of a mission whether we're gonna figure out if they're biting on minnows are they biting on trout bait are they what are they doing we're trying to learn today yeah so this swivels just barely going into the water our trigger is set super duper light and our drag should be good There we go, we got one jacker set in here. Here we go, here we go, monster. No way. Oh my gosh, tank. Oh my tank. gosh, I seen it, I seen it. Tank. <gasps> tank. Shh. Another one. No way. On the bottom. No way. He's on, he's on. <laughs> big cam, see, big. I mean, you got that on the aqua Honey, view. big cam, big cam, big cam. <laughs> We're on. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's huge. It's huge. Yes. Come on, girl. Ooh. Oh, it's a good one. Baby, come on, baby. Come on, baby. Get out. Oh. Come on. She does not want to come up. No. Have that tail if you can. 
There she is. <laughs> yeah, babe. Look at that. Oh my gosh, look how pretty it is. It's huge. Oh my god. All right. That's insane. That's a giant. Oh. Grab the, the, the bump board. I just want to bump it, get a measurement. And then we'll do some pictures. Barely hooked in the corner of the mouth. Okay, it's unhooked. We're gonna measure this fish really quick. Oh my goodness. Ooh, nice slap. Yeah, right? Come on, girl. So this is an 18 inch, wait, 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 17 and three core, like literally as it sits here, mouth open, it's 18 inches. All right, quick camera. 18 inch brookie guys this is my biggest brookie ever and she's gonna go back we're gonna let her back oh my gosh oh we did it <laughs> literally like i just put that minnow down there and whack like you seen it come through that's rolling i didn't even think we had that rolling yet and we got it on there we no the way on there no the background. you seen it bite yes no yes what yeah. <laughs> Dude, all right, let's do it again. Let's see if we got you a bigger one. An eight, okay, literally it was like, not even an eighth inch. It was like 17 and 15 sixteenths from being an 18 inch brookie. 18, I'm calling it 18. We're fishing, it's an 18er. Like, that thing is gorgeous. All right, let's do it again. What? Oh my gosh. My turn. Oh my gosh. So that means it was pointing this way then, I see, okay. All right, well, we're on the board with an 18 incher. Oh. All right, let's get this guy set up again. I literally like didn't even have it, ha barely had it set. There it is. So we decided when we're jigging, we're going to jig with minnows. So should we, should probably hook it in the back? Cause then if it eats its head, then it'll eat the hook. You know what I mean? Sure. I'm gonna give you the super duper tiny one. So you have like a better chance. Thanks. That. Yeah, no problem. So super duper tiny one, your jig's sitting like this. This minnow, we're gonna want to tail hook him right on the bottom of the tail. So they'll eat it head first, hopefully. And then your jig should be laying right in its lip. Just like that. Check it out. Okay, you should be <clears throat> you should be on the camera. And then I'm going to drop mine down. You're there. Check your drag. Better, the looser, the better. You're way down there. But that one fish was cruising bottom pretty good. All right, so there's mine with my minnow. And right there's now, fish. oh my gosh, there is. We're using jigs and minnows. Fish. God, that's a nice one. Jig, jig, jig. We literally just dropped down fish. He's like, they're all cruising different like heights. There we go. Take it, honey. That's a big one. Nice and easy. Just lift. Here's the swivel. Oh, it's a little guy. Hang on, hang on. Snagged? Is that what you I said? don't know. I don't know if he's snagged or not. It came up backwards. Yeah, weird. Cool. Super weird. Super weird. He's got a hook hooked in the side of him. He might have like swirled around it. Maybe. All right, we got a nice, that's a buck. He's got a little kipe on him. Does he? Yeah. All right, kneel down here. I'll get you some pictures. <laughs> this is insane. All right, let's put him in the bumper quick. Some water in there for him. Nose first. What's he out at? 12 incher? Yeah. 12 inches. Yeah. 12 inches. Let right, him go. Bud. Babe, woo! Kind of hooked funny. But I don't care. I'll take it. Yeah. That was sweet. Mm -hmm. That was sweet. So I bought these this morning thinking, uh, you know, these trout have been pellet fed 
for most of their life. These kind of look like a pellet. So I think it's like a rat finky or something. So just brown. Maybe they'll eat this. Maybe it looks like a bug. So I'm going to put this on. Like, what is this thing even? That looks really good for what it is. Check it, check it, check it out. Watch something just rail and just, just keep going with it. Doesn't even stop. Yep, 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 here we go. Oh, oh, come back, come back, come back. He likes my little brown thing. He does like your little brown thing. Little oh, squirt. I got the spins. That fish came out of nowhere. So he was to the right of the aqua view, so he came out. He was in deeper water. I thought he had it when I hooked at it, but I guess he didn't. But he's around. So outside, our trout doe hasn't done anything. So I'm going to take a minnow to that one. We're going to put a minnow outside. No way. Catch it. Catch it. There's still some putty on this hook from that trout doe, but he should wear it off. Is the camera still rolling? Camera's still rolling? All right, now we got a minnow outside. Well, we're just getting set up at the new spot here. We figured, let's move. Let's see if we can, you know, catch some other fish in a different spot. Um, so I just want to kind of go over what we're using here. So this is a jaw jacker. This is a, you know, obviously an automatic hook setter. Um, if you haven't seen one of those, that's what it does. It has a little trigger on it. Um, this rod that I'm using, this is a Berkley Amped Ice. Uh, it's a little 32 inch. It actually came with a little reel, but then we put the PC Fun Carbon X2 on here. Again, guys, if you're looking for reels, they're, they're nice. Um, use discount code WF15, check them out. But uh, yeah, basically this just goes into there. You have the little red knot on the top of there that comes with uh, comes with the jaw jacker. You lock it in the front, you put the trigger over, and then when the fish pulls on your line, boom, it pops it up and that's what we're doing. Obviously you've seen it work earlier this morning, so just kind of wanted to go over that and show that to you. All right, well, midday update. We moved to the other end of the lake and uh we're now running three jaw jackers inside we have this one that one we have one over here by me and then jigging with the camera exactly how we were before so just did a little move I'm thinking i don't know we didn't see any fish down there for like an hour so we'll fish for another little bit here and see if we can see some more also we were out here a couple weeks ago and the reason we came back was because of this footage right here so enjoy this footage What is going on, Bluegill? Oh, he almost had you. Is he, he's trying. He's trying. You letting him swim with it? Yep. Oh, you got him! <laughs> That's awesome. On the minnow. That's so cool. You're like, suck it in, suck it all the way in. And then and she, he did. Oh my goodness. Enough so I could get him hooked. Yep. That's why we tail hook them like that so they take the head and boom. That was really cool. 
that was sweet. Good job. I even had a jig and a waxy, and here you are jigging minnow. Right. <laughs> he he wanted that minnow. That's yeah. a good minnow, too. He came after that thing two different times. That's, That's wild. So cool. Well, just getting some stuff packed up here, and uh, we managed, you managed, one more bluegill. So it was pretty slow, but you know, if we didn't move spots, we would have been like, what if we would have moved? So at least we tried moving. Um, got one giant one this morning. We will be back. And the thing that I like to do is I like to do like different things, like not the same thing every time. So we're going to be trout fishing. We're going to be bluegill fishing. We're going to be crappie fishing, walleye fishing. You name it, we're probably going to be trying to target it through the ice. So yeah with that being said thanks for watching hope you guys enjoyed if you haven't subscribed yet love it if you hit the subscribe subscribe button and like always see you next time